ever wonder how you could give feedback in the midst of like sexy fun and not actually break the whole mood, not send all of the sexy energy and excitement just immediately out the window by saying stop or don't do that or do this. Well, I'm Beth Darling, your sexy genius, and I there's some very easy ways that you can do this because when you're involved in sexy fun, I want you to get exactly what you want in a way that feels good for you. But this came about because one of my clients was telling me that in the midst of sexy stuff, her guy started jackhammering, right? Just, just fucking, they were in missionary position, fucking, fucking, fucking away um, like a jackhammer. And that's not what she's into. So she's like, stop, please don't, don't do that. And again, all the energy just gone. Okay. He got defensive, of course, like he didn't want to do something wrong, but he didn't know. And it just blew everything. So what I suggested to her was that next time, instead of saying stop, what she could do is put her hands on his hips, look him in the eye and tell him, wait, I need you to just stay right there for just a minute. Oh, I like it right there. And then say, oh, I'd love to feel it slow. I want to feel you going in and out really slowly. I promise if she does that, all the sexy energy stays in the room. It stays present. She's getting what she's wanting. She stopped the action she didn't. She didn't like the jackhammer. She stopped that literally in its tracks. And now she's shifting it into something she does want. So the key is that when you do that, when you make eye contact, when you do feel, you're changing it from people getting in their head, right? Stop, takes everybody out of our body into our head. Oh, what? We're analyzing. What's wrong? What do we do? What do we do next? And that's where the energy goes out, okay? So you want to keep people in their body. And so I say, the worst question to ask for someone is like, is this good? Okay, that's a silly question. That's a analyze it question. Take somebody out of their body, right? You're looking, you're eating me out. It feels so good. And then you say, is it good? I have to get out of my body where it's feeling good and go into my head and go, is this good? Okay. So instead ask, oh, do you like it when I lick you here or lick you here? Which one's better? Okay. That's keeping me in my body. I'm just paying attention to the sensations. And um, oh, that one, that one, that one, that one, right? Okay. So do that. Think about how to keep people in their body. Give feedback, give pointers, give advice, move them with your hands. Don't use your head so much. Okay. That's how you can get feedback, get the sexy fun that you want in a way that feels good to you and not just ruin the moment. All right, I'm Beth Darling, your sexy genius. Please, if you like this video, like and subscribe to this channel and that way you'll always know what's coming next. There's a zillion others that you've already, like that are already up there. So go back and watch any of them and please give comments below. Let me know what you like, what your feedback is. And also, how about going to sexyedschool.com? That's my website. It's my classes on blowjobs, cunnilingus, prostate pleasure for men as well as my Come With Us podcast and my book, Love and Laughter, Sexy, Meaningful, Fun for Everyone. So go to sexyedschool.com, sign up for our newsletter. You'll get a free erotic short story and you'll be on my newsletter. You'll get a little love letter from me about once a week. All right, big hugs and love. See you next time. Keep it sexy. Bye.